<laughs> probably, yeah. Probably. Want your share back? Good day, YouTube, Thanks. and welcome to All another right. episode of the Albino Rhino Beer Review. The you Rhino, you be have the... Mantos. What were, what were, no, not Mantos. I can't we'll see the... Ladlob. 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 All the names. Kinder Flinger. Which one? Kinder Flinger. I've never heard that one. you never heard that one? No, there's like 107. Yeah. We plastered my fucking Lorianne's the one with every name you could think of. Uh, we have this from Wellington. It's 6.8% uh, alcohol. It is the Wellington's Winter Lager. Um, this, I've actually, it's it's probably fairly old because I've seen it at the LCBO for months because nobody wants to buy it. Because who wants to buy an $8 lager, right? Like, I pass that by so many times. Fuck that! Who's the head brewer at this one? Because I know we met him. So uh, I remember going to film there. Actually... Has it changed? Marvin Dick is still Marvin Dick is still the head brewer there. <laughs> However, in case you didn't catch it the first. Yeah. Time. My for, name's Marvin Dick. For uh, oh, and, your name's and Dick. The, the other husband isn't down here anymore. I do not believe. But I'm for his cousin. Any, anyone that uh, anyone that hasn't met him, George Eagleson, who was the head brewer at Stonehenge, is Eagle. now a brewer over there. <laughs> and he is probably the coolest guy I've met in the in the industry. All right. So if this beer sucks, we can force him to eat a Wellington. Yes. No, make him drink a Trafalgar. Water. <laughs> 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 Trafalgar isn't owned by Trafalgar anymore. Michael Arnold sold it. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Mm. Did you finally realize it's a piece of shit? <laughs> and then there's that. And then there's that. That's a PC answer. That's a PC answer right there. Uh, yeah. I like the little head wobble. Yes, we haven't forgotten about you, you greasy twat. <laughs> Uh, That's an insult to grease and twat. So you see, <laughs> yeah, it was on the greasy side of things. I thought, I thought <laughs> that brewery would end up going. I thought that brewery would end up going to his son. Uh, Why you and, dry, mingy, stubble man? <laughs> oh, you did the <laughs> Oh, president. Oh, that, that has a little oh, bit of haze. Oh, president. A little bit. A little bit of haze, a golden bit. color. Uh, mingy. <laughs> not really a smell at all. There's something there. I was just saying there's while you were outside, uh, George Eagleson is now one of the brewers at Wellington. Oh, yeah? And if this sucks, we're going to make him eat one. Mm -hmm. hmm. Yeah, it, it doesn't have much scent at all. Who's in bread? Uh, let's let's yeah, try it. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Cheers. Ready. Cheers. It's a lager? Yeah, it's nothing. It kind of yeah. tastes like... It, it tastes is literally nothing. That's all I, I would it, say yeah. it's more like a Vienna lager because it has a little bit of that back <laughs> punch. A little bit, of yeah, yeah, that a little punch, bit but not much. Nothing really. Like no. like straw and a little bit of hoppiness. Can it's I slightly causing my right eye to close. Can I say that it's bad? <laughs> <laughs> can I say it's bad? Not at all. Typical uh, Ontario craft lager. Can, can, I, can I say it's good? Again, probably not at all. I mean, it's it's a beer. But I mean, it, yeah, it's a seven fifty. But do I want to pay uh, six ninety five plus deposit on this beer? No, no. For that amount of money, I would drive over the border. What the fuck was the name of that fucking dollar fucking? Oh, the dollar ninety nine six pack? No, no, it wasn't dollar ninety. No, no, it was a one large mass steel reserve. Steel, oh, steel reserve. Oh, yes. 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 Yeah, I drink all those shits. Mm -hmm. But yeah, yeah like all this, this, it tastes a little like blue. This isn't it a bad no beer, beer, but when, when, like you beer. Figure, when you figure it's a seven dollar and five cent beer after you add the deposit to it, is it worthwhile? No, no, wait, that's I mean, American, right? No, no that's Canadian. Canadian. Because I mean, you can buy you can buy almost three beers for that price in five hundred yep. milliliter cans. Yep. and they may be blue. It's two beers in a blowjob. <laughs> Where, Who is Where do you get that deal? <laughs> job for Dude, a dollar? It's a sale, man. The bit, the bit under the that bridge. you guys wrote my wife under was seeing earlier. Under the bridge. In a man down by the river. Is the transvestite comment from earlier. <laughs> We're assuming that was maybe a shiny nickel. <laughs> and I say maybe because I'm not sure if it's See, he will do it. It. Kind of bready, it's slight touch of sweetness. <laughs> bready, sweetness, and a bit of hops. Yeah. Not a bad beer. I'll give it a 5 out of 10 because it's not a bad beer. It's just not not something I want to pay that money for. And yeah. that's not saying anything bad about Wellington because I think they make some fine beers. They've made a lot of fine Rubber beers. Boot. But this just isn't for me. I'd go a 3. Already? Mostly because it <laughs> tastes <laughs> like uh, it. Three. Yeah, yeah, three. Three. Yeah. 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 Alrighty. Anyone else want to give a rating that's had it? I'll give it a 7. Just drink it? He had three of them. Nope. <laughs> nope. <he didn't>. Nope. <laughs> Just on the looks of the bottle alone. 
<laughs> seven! You can bottle someone real good with that bottle. Yes. Gives it a seven. This would be a five if it wasn't so overpriced, so it's obviously a four. <coughs> I'm with boy check on this one. I went three. It's a four. I'm going low on it. Four, <laughs> four easily, yeah. Yep. Seven! Already. Out of a hundred. Bye. Night, night. <laughs> it's gone.